Now, <clears throat> when it comes to the grip structure, we do have a new tool. Um, if you don't see it in your account quite yet, you can write to support and we'll give you the link to it. Uh, but it's in a utility tool, create grip structure. It's a very simple tool. All it does is it takes your existing product group structure. And if it's not taking it down to the lowest level of product IDs, it's going to say, okay, under this particular ad group, we're gonna make 170 new product groups so that every product from this falls into its own product group. Um, and you can see the current split that they've done here is based on the brand and then Google category zero and then product type zero. And then finally we get to individual products within this. So here you can actually notice <clears throat> that the, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, that the, the advertiser was taking the same bag, but of different sizes. And they had grouped all of those under this grouping. And that's a sensible grouping. But again, if you now have an insight and you start finding that for photographer bags, uh, large ones do much better than small ones. You can't actually act on this because the small and the large are in the same product group. Therefore, they must have the same bid. What we're going to do here is we're going to split it out so that each of these is in its own entity. And then I can approve it from here or I can do a bulk approval and I can apply the changes and then your grip structure is gonna be live in AdWords in just a couple of uh, seconds.